Hello YouTube, Colin, MM0PX here. Just wanted to give you a quick run through of the adjusted wave light uh, antenna system and what you get with the kit. So this is in, this is this is everything you get with the kit. You get the the main box, um, you get the top clamp, and you get the three arms that's required. So one of the arms screws into here, like this. And obviously the other two arms like this and like this. So as standard, this uh, this system will fit the Spider Beam 12 meter uh, HD pole. This clamp here in the middle, this rubber clamp in the middle, will will clamp onto the second last section. Uh, it's 12 mm diameter and the, slight, the spider beam pole is slightly bigger so it, it, it gives it a nice snug fit so that just slides over the top. You don't need to undo these cap screws once you get them tightened up, slide it snugly over and it will fit. On the main box itself we have rubber clamps again. These are 52 mm diameter so these fit directly onto the bottom section of the 12 meter spider beam pole. Um, obviously with this version here there's no choke balance included and um, there's a lot of debate whether you need one with a ground mounted vertical and as this is going to be that's what it's going to be then, uh, then I don't think you need it so in place of the adjustable radio we just have we still have the the swing bolt so this could be used you could fit an adjustable radio to this it's adjustable radio ready um, but what I have on here is just a few nuts and bolts, wing nut. So what you can actually do is just connect radials to this. Um, you don't need many radials. Um, if you want to know how many radials, if you look at DX Commander's uh, YouTube page, he's got a couple of very, very good videos that tells you how many radials you need. Um, so if you make it, if you make enough radials for 80 meters, then that's going to be more than enough for every other band. And that's going to let you get out uh, very, very well. Uh, all the hardware on it, as you've probably seen, is stainless steel. Everything is stainless steel. So it should last uh, a good long time outside. Obviously, these bolts, stainless steel. Um, uh, these are these are a type of uh, heavy-duty pulley, kite pulley. They're very, very good. I uh, haven't had any issues so far with these. Um, so there you have it. So that's the adjusted wave light. I think I've covered covered everything. Um, one last thing, as I said, I make this standard to fit the 12 meter spider beam pole, but you can see that I have another hole position here. So these are class six clamps. If you if you look at pipe clamps and you look at class five and six, what you do is you take out this bolt. You can put it into this position, and you can use a smaller clamp. Um, which I'm going to do. I do have a DX Commander uh, 10 meter pole and I'm going to try that out with the adjust the wave uh, antenna system. Uh, I won't get 80 meters on it because it's a little bit lighter than the lighter duty than the spider beam but it should be good for 40 meters anyway um, but we'll be linear loading uh, on, on 40. So I've looked at the pole already. I reckon I could remove two or three of the top sections and clamp, clamp on um, below those and it should be okay. So I need to order a couple of smaller um, smaller clamps and they will they will clamp to this. So we'll remove this, put it to here and then I could fit the smaller clamp. So it's very, very versatile antenna system um, and it's going to get you a lot of good contacts. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye-bye for now.